In this lesson, I want to explain how to use scene states. Very interesting feature in CLAMP Composer. You can store the transform material uh, of any object and the scene, and you can change it very easy. I will explain it. Select here, scene state. I'll pin that. If you click capture, you can capture the material, transform, lighting, sun, camera position, and uh, show and hide from the selection object or whole scene. I begin with this, this selection object or uh, this, this selection object and its material. <clears throat> Untick all of these. Okay, this is uh, when you active the transform, the anima animate the transform for VR, explain it. But I want to just store the material state of this object and I have to select uh, uh, capture from selection uh, this matter first material is this and capture it from the selection and if you go to the scene state tab we have uh, this scene state here you can delete all of them and capture from selection again select any that desired object and selection Oh, I select it and just delete that. Okay, this is the scene state for that material. We have a tab here for default and in a manage, in, it, in the scene state uh, menu, in a manage, you can manage uh, any tab you want. For example, I manage uh, mat uh, object number one and hit OK and OK and select that and delete that. This is a default tab. Go into the mat for organizing your selection, select your object and capture. It goes here, okay? You can manage your tab here. And uh, simply go into the material and change its material. Click and drag on it and capture it again. Go to other material, select another material and capture from selection just the material i want just to capture the material going to the scene state as you can see we have several scene state that store uh, different material for that object for changing that you can simply click and drag to the scene but just that object will be changed its material okay i bring it to this second material and in a vr with a simple click you can change it material it's very interesting this is a first example for changing material Okay, select the object, go into the object, and now the time is for uh, <clears throat> uh, explain the object action. It means if you click on this object, what happened to that object? This is object action. Here, I want to, when I want to click, I, I want to change the scene state. I will explain them. For example, if you click that object uh, URL, in a website will be open or an animation play, an animation state. If you select object, you can play a sound or anything. First of first, I use multi action because I want to click, 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 click and change the uh, action. The simplest way is now we are going to uh, interactive, oh, sorry, uh, <clears throat> VRFX and and select create scene state lister it can list your scene state and you can simply click on them you can stretch this scene state very easy do not worry about the stretch the texture this is just a um, symbol and texture you can list your matter uh, your scene state here go to vr scene state lister you can add any title you want. For example, change a matte object <clears throat> one. You can change the font color. You can list background maximum uh, string lengths, or you can add in a separate page. That's it. And it lists all of the scene states from the scene. Unfortunately, you cannot choose which, for example, tab do you want. Okay, go to the VR desktop. 
that list will be open for you and here as you can see scene 7 scene 8 scene 9 we have all the scene here if you click on them as you can see you can change the texture of the material of that object okay this is first benefit of that object and change material number one at least is here if you have more uh scene state you can change it and from the here you can change the scene state scene list it's very easy another interesting way is clicking on the object i want to explain select that object go into the object and here i want to first just select the scene uh, multi-action the multi-action means if you want to click on object in which click what happened loop i need a loop because i want to loop and loop and change the uh, this material or you can randomly select that or run all or swing i'll explain that more first you have to select the loop here this, uh, uh, you have to specify which action do you want click on this three icon and you can programming your click with the first click with the first click you can add what which type do you want as you can see all of that list uh, will be open because we can add a multi action here i want to first click a scene state action and a scene state appear or uh, execute the software <clears throat> tell you which scene state do you want as you can see this is the first material of the object i want to next scene state just click on a scene state it's activated here it's appear here and hit okay as you can see so pay attention to the first scene state do not click that because we are this is a default material and i want to when i click to that it gets to, it's go to that scene and plus again and i want to after another click i want to um, uh, play in a scene state the red one and after that i want to go back to the first default material scene state and select the scene state 7 and hit ok and everything is ready and you can go now to the vr viewer and simply you can bring your mouse as you can see if you hold your mouse the software tell you which object is interactively changing click 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 as you can see with a loop you can with any click you can change the scene state and apply the scene state to that object interesting another capture scene state is capture transform it's very simple you can uh, capture this uh, transform the object position rotation and scale okay first i click here and add a new group or new tab here but uh, if you select it uh, unfortunately you can change the name going to the manage and add and here you can <coughs> rename it uh object uh transform okay this is an uh, oh, hit okay and this is an object transform select it because we want to organize it this is for this object material and this tab is for <coughs> transform capturing of that object i just select the capture you can select whole things but we don't need capture the first position rotation and position of the object select the uh, capture selection i explain this button for hole changing and as you can see this uh, position will be captured here you can change the position and the rotation of the object and the capture it as you can see you can bring it here and make it a bigger and capture from selection as you can see if you click and drag you can bring the back any position of that object it is interesting like this or <clears throat> you can click click or you can use the scene lister for changing the uh, rotation and position of that but unfortunately if you use the lister you can just uh, assign whole <clears throat> whole uh, scene state in a software bot 
Unfortunately, you cannot change anything. Which tab, for example, do you want to add it? Okay, as you can see, if you go to the scene, the <clears throat> viewer, you can see whole scenes here. But that's good. As you can see, scene here, you can select it. As you can see, change the that material and this scene, you can change the I'm going up and you can change the position rotation of that object. Unfortunately, it show all of the scenes that uh, are in the software. Okay, uh, as I said before, you can select with a multi-action in an object and add to click, click and <clears throat> change the position of that. Another capture is lighting and the sun that I explained it to switching between date and light. I explained that it's very easy. And here you can capture, hide and show the object. For example, this object, if you want to click capture, hide and show, you can go in here and hide the object and capture it or show it, capture it, you can use it. And sometimes it's very interesting. And here you can capture the position of the object. For example, uh, the position of the camera. I explain them separately. For example, I like this position and the capture uh, camera. That's not, you can select the selection. We, we do not have select any camera, but you can select whole scene. As you can see whole scene, the when you select the scene, the default camera will be captured. Or you can <clears throat> bring it here, as you can see, simply you can click and drag and change the scene. And after that, if you want to render, you can add your scene to your render if you want. Okay, you can select it and here you can delete it or you can refresh it as you want. Here. You can regenerate selection or capture the scene. That's this button. Okay, this is uh, scene states. You can uh, do a lot of things with that. Okay. In the next lesson, I will explain the light switching to uh, add a switch here and you can click to changing the light, changing to the night to the light. Hello, my friends. To continue these tutorials on YouTube, subscribe us, like us and hit the bell icon. And now you will be alerted about all of the amazing videos that we release.